What I realized um, trying to be an actor in Toronto, and I would go into these auditions sort of day in and day out, and and just felt like kind of empty about it all. I remember seeing this ad for a journalism program at Seneca College, and I'd all I'd already gone to do my university degree at Queens. I went, and literally the first day, I was like, "This is what I want to do." And what I realized in that moment that everything that I had done up until this point had prepared me for this job. Uh, we were all big into sports and theater and that, that type of thing. And um, we were very active kids, so they also wanted to make sure that they were nurturing that part of ourselves. So they found that the full experience really was um, very beneficial at a, at a private school. It was the right learning environment for me because I felt comfortable in the classroom and I felt comfortable enough to get up and speak. And to have a teacher tell you you're good at something and to embrace that and to nurture it and to grow it and to encourage as well. Uh, that for me was anything dramatic, theater, public speaking, all that stuff was really nurtured there. There was a lot of fun in learning, which makes it so important, uh, makes it exciting, makes me want to go to school in the morning. For some reason, we walked into Branks and it just felt right. All we talk about every day is what's going on in the world and what's going on here at home, outside our door. I would have to say what's grown from that and being in the news for the last, I guess, seven years. Um, I'm very passionate about tolerance, that's a big one for me. Now I'm going back and trying to give back to the school, like that's how much I, I feel like it impacted my life. I think a lot of it was to do with confidence building um, and feeling comfortable in my own skin, especially as a young woman. I was always a big um, fan of school, I, a nerd that way.